give my creation life! Another turning point, a fork stuck in the road Time grabs you by the wrist, directs you where to go So make the best of this test and don't ask why It's not a question but a lesson learned in time It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right I hope you had the time of your life So take the photographs and still friends in your mind Hanging on a shelf in good health and good time Tattoos and memories and dead skin on trial For what it's worth, it was worth all the while It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right I hope you had the time of your life But in the end it's right I hope you had the time of your life It's 
something unpredictable, but in the end is right. I hope you had the time of your life. For more than a century, the Eastman Kodak Company has been part of our lives, our memories, and our future. Continually pioneering technologies that make the process of taking pictures easier and the results remarkably better. Allowing us all to share the precious moments we treasure, the benchmarks of our lives with those we love. In fact, many of us fondly refer to those special times as Kodak moments. Gets you misty, doesn't it? Yep, they shoveled on the schmaltz pretty thick, didn't they? But that kind of crap doesn't work anymore. People want the latest digital things. More power, more features, wireless contraptions, innovative ways to bring their pictures into the 21st century. Well, guess what, bucko? Kodak is doing it. You thought they were just hiding out, waiting for this digital thing to blow over, didn't you? Oh, sure, for a while they were like, oh, there's no way digital's gonna catch on. Hell, 20 years ago, they pawned the first digital camera off on Apple. But now, Kodak is back. They're taking this digital thing to a level undreamed of. Pioneering technology that'll redefine the digital revolution. I know, big talk coming from the company that unleashed Advantix onto the world, right? Well, turn down your mini-disc player, fire up your Newtons, and listen up, because they're not playing grab-ass anymore. They've got things in their research labs that'll make biometrics look like a Happy Meal toy. I'm talking facial recognition, GPS-enabled photography so my camera knows where it is, pictures that learn and group themselves into stories. We're talking meta-knowledge, cameras that automatically enhance the color of the grass because they know it's grass. Try and patent that. Oh, too late. <laughs> and what about sharing? I'll tell you about sharing. All your friends and family will be emailing their pictures wirelessly to you and sending pictures of grandma's birthday to your phone and uploading shots of the dog wearing those big stupid sunglasses to your PDA. And they're going to be everywhere because now you won't have to be a Navajo code breaker to use digital. And they're all going to look like freaking Eddie Leibowitz shot them because they'll automatically adjust the lighting and the composition for you. No more flash problems, no more red eye. How's that for advanced? Booyah! You know what the best part is? They're gonna turn the schmaltz back up to 11. Oh, yes. People will have their Kodak moments again. They're gonna bring back all those damn pictures of the cute puppies and the cuddly kittens and the cooing babies and that, that doe-eyed kid. You know the one. They're bringing them all back, all in the same spot. And it's gonna be 15 minutes long. And James Cameron will direct it. And Celine Dion will sing the theme song while riding along on a unicorn through a field of baby animals under a big blue sky. And there's not a damn thing you can do to stop it. You were a Kodak moment once, and by God, you'll be one again. Only this time, it's digital. Oh, yeah!
changing of sunlight to moonlight reflections of my life oh how they fill my eyes the beatings of people in trouble reflections of my life oh how they fill Changing, arranging, I'm changing, I'm changing. 